In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to stitch a running stitch. Running stitch can be worked in both straight and curved lines and is one of the most common stitches used across all different styles of sewing. I mainly use running stitch when I'm outlining, lettering, hand quilting, top stitching or doing slow stitching and borrow. Running stitches usually work from the right to the left, however left handed stitches may prefer to work in the opposite direction. To start, Bring your needle up at the starting point and take your needle and thread back through after a short distance to create a single stitch. Bring your needle back up a short distance from the end of your stitch and repeat again. Stitching one stitch at a time will help to keep your stitches even, however you can weave your needle in and out of the fabric, causing it to gather on your needle and then pull the needle through to create several stitches at a time. To finish, I'm going to flip my work over and thread my needle back through the last one or two stitches and then through the loop, pull tight and tie a knot. I'll snip my thread off for a nice clean finish and then I'm ready to start my next line of stitching. Stitching a curved line in running stitch is exactly the same. Follow the direction of the line and stitch small single stitches with spaces between them. You may find that moving your hoop around as you stitch can help when working in different directions. It's really fun to play around with this stitch. You can also try varying both your stitch length and the spaces in between to achieve different styles. So now you know how to do a running stitch. Thanks for watching!